When you're executively producing an album, what does that actually entail? Because a lot of, like, we can see your name on all the Celine credits as right. executive producer. Right. So executive producer, what it does, what I do is, it's basically put together the, the uh, recording sessions, making sure that she's surrounded with all the best uh, producers, all the best producers, all the best uh, uh, musicians, best mixers, uh, best uh, arrangers, and that's what I'm. That's what an executive producer does. Plus, pays for it. <laughs> yeah. Before it was Sony paying for it, where now it's Lupo One that pays for it, okay. which is my label. Yeah. And with that label, it's just for the people who are having their independent labels, um, you've basically spoken about product placement, which a lot of people are seeing as a way to offset um, costs. Are there other things that you look at as seeing a more effective and more, a better way to streamline your costs in terms of, okay, we may not need to spend money out of our pockets, we can get someone else to do something outside of the Well, years. I try, you know, in Canada, there's a, there's a grant that the government gives you up to a certain amount. But for the record itself, I, I, I like to pay it myself. I don't want to own anything to anybody. We want to own it. So it's our, it's our production, it's our album, it's everything. Um, sometimes, like right now, I'm looking at, looking at some sponsors. I'm looking at some, uh, you know, people like, let's say, um, maybe a watch company. You know, might want to put it on, on her, in her video. So if that happens, then there's a portion that they will pay for the video. There's that happening. But most of the time, uh, she's a lucky girl. I've done it myself. <laughs>